I was a big fan of the original Meg, and um, and basically got sent the Meg Two script by my agent, and I was like, oh wow, the Meg Two. How could I, basically it was that? It was like, how can I not do this? Whatever this is, I'm going to do it. So, um, and then I read it, and I really enjoyed it. And I think the main thing that got me was the kind of um, it's the Jonas characters and all the characters need to fight on and keep moving forward at all times. Going back to the things that I think people liked about the first one, what I liked about it was like the, I wanted to see the Megs destroying more stuff, fundamentally, eating more people. Um, I wanted to see uh, Jonas Taylor in mu and, and, and his crew in much more difficult situations and under much more pressure and see how they acted in those situations. <laughs> what was exciting about this film was that it was taking the original Meg and then supercharging it and giving it bigger creatures, bigger action, um, bigger monsters, bigger environments, bigger equipment, you know, it's the whole thing. I would describe this film as the perfect kind of popcorn movie. It's like, it's it, it's the, it's a film that I've been waiting to see for, for years. I just want to, you know, I love action movies and I love movies that have um, people going on a mission and I love peop uh, movies where they explore you know, and they find different places and it's all, you go, oh my God, this is amazing. And then they go on to the next place and then there's danger. Um, and I think that's the, that's something I, I seem to have been missing from movies for a while, you know, that, that kind of feeling of a journey, but also with um, giant action in it. Working with Jason, he's like, he is obviously an absolute expert and master at all this action stuff, you know, so he knows exactly what he's doing in that respect. Um, and then as a performer, he he brings that solidness to the role, you know. When he's on set, he's kind of, you know, just straight there, straight on it, getting it done. With Wu Jin, he's obviously, you know, a director as well as a, a performer. So he understands so many of, you know, so many of the elements of it. And, and he has done so much action stuff. So he's, again, like Jason, he knows exactly what he's doing. So it's almost like I learn from them as much as I'm, I'm, I'm directing them, but I'm not telling them, you know, because they know what they're doing. So there's there's an element of that, and I think that Wu Jin also has a, you know, he's, he has a sense of comedy and a sense of comedy timing as well, which is really brilliant. I think for a blockbuster movie, it's it's interesting to have a lot of variety, you know. So you've got in this film there is um, they fight monsters, there's hand to hand action, there's chases. There's um, being menaced by Megs that you can't defend yourself against. And, and then there's um, kind of uh, being attacked by tentacles and um, fighting in helicopters. It's like everything. It's got tons and tons and tons of stuff. So for um, and for me, that was that was such a uh, it was so fun.